Alright, today I'm going to be doing an update on my 2006 TRX450R. Um, last time I made a video I showed off the graphics a little bit, but I can really give you guys a better view of what they look like now that I'm outside and everything. So, you can check that out. Pretty awesome. Super stoked on those Chaos MX graphics. Uh, second thing I did is I traded the White Bros for a HMF full exhaust. And the reason I did that is because I need a spark arrestor to go to the dunes. And the White Bros, you know, obviously they're out of business and they got bought up by Vance and Hines. And I couldn't get a spark arrestor from them. And I couldn't find any used. So this way I can at least, you know, buy one and I can replace parts on it. You know, I can get a new badge, new end cap, all that kind of stuff. And, you know, HMF's a good brand, so I'm, I'm happy with it. Um... Also, I did ride with it a little bit, and it definitely has more power, um, actually, than the, the White Bros, in my opinion. Um, I think that you sacrifice a little bit of bottom end, but you get a little more bend rage pull, so... I don't know, it's a good trade-off. I like it. Um, I mean, pretty basic stuff, like levers and grips, you know? How all that updated. I got that aluminum gas cap... Um, uh, Tusk Nerf Bars, you know, just aftermarket aluminum wheels, I don't even know the brand off the top of my head, but just real basic stuff. I have the Cascade parking brake block off from my 400EX actually on here, right there. Um, yeah, that pretty much covers it. I, I think it's got like a DG bumper, but I don't even remember looks stock, so whatever. <laughs> um, and then I got this new PRM bumper, which I bought it because it looks a lot like the Wrath Racing bumper. I mean, obviously a little bit different, but I like the look of it. And, uh, I don't know, it's just a good bumper, plus I got a number plate that's not on there right now, but that'll be good. Um, and then I got these Fox Podium X shocks, which are actually stock Polaris Predator shocks, um, but I modified the bushings up top there, and then backed off the preload like a whole inch, and they work awesome, so way softer, way smoother ride. You know, obviously not perfect, but it's better than stock by a long shot. You know, anyone with a TRX 450R knows, you know, these stock front shocks are pretty stiff, pretty harsh, so that'll be a good upgrade, and then I'm going to add a couple other things to it in the next couple months here, possibly, and possibly going to make a build video on that, um, but my mom is actually in the market for a quad, and she's going to go pick up uh, an LTR, so I am going to do a little bit of test riding on that, and depending on how that goes and you know how I like that, I may switch to a Suzuki. Um, but I, I like my Honda and I've obviously switched back to a Honda for a reason. So I don't know. We'll see. Um, it's just a lot cheaper, you know, to be at 50 inches wide and, and all that stuff when the quad comes that way stock. So, uh, for me, that'd be a huge benefit, but we'll just have to wait and see how things go there. Um, yeah, I think that pretty much covers everything off the top of my head. Um, yeah. So I will start the quad up here and do a little bit of sound test since I got the, the new exhaust on there. It does definitely sound different. I can tell you that much. Find the choke here. And turn the gas on. All right. Make the choke switch back off. Yep. Okay. I don't know if anyone else has this problem, but my choke always ends up 
flipping back off on me really easily. It doesn't stay out on its own. So. So there you go, that is a complete walk around of my 2006 TRX450R. Like I said, I'll keep you guys updated with a build in the near future or possibly a different quad. We'll see how things turn out, but it's probably going to look this way for you know a couple months or so. Um, and as soon as I have more time on my hands, obviously with college and everything, and as soon as the weather gets better here, I'll try and make another video. Um, so, yeah. Make sure to like the video, subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Thanks, guys.